is a Buffalo High School student. He's also a barber, and now he's become a viral YouTube sensation. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Jetty Johnson has the story tonight of how the Buffalo strong spirit has affected this teenager, and now he's using his platform to inspire. Two years ago, Kevin Northington, otherwise known as Weavy Kid Kev, was gifted his first pair of clippers. Oh yes, Oster Fast Fees, I think from Walmart. <laughs> Two years later, mom says he has more than he needs if you ask me. And he doesn't plan on slowing down anytime soon. Kevin is in his senior year at Burgard High School in Buffalo. And at 17, he's also a licensed barber. Where do you do your haircuts, here? No, I do, I do them at a shop at um, 1849 Genesee Street. But it took him a few years to get there. I was only 14 when I first started. And he was like, oh yeah, you're not old enough yet, you're not old enough yet, and I just hated hearing that. So Kevin took matters into his own hands and began practicing on himself, his family, and friends. Well, at first, a lot of them, they didn't want to come because, you know, they was a little skeptical at first, and then once they started coming, and I started getting better and better, and they'd be like, oh yeah, this look good, this look good. Hey, I'm so I'm saying, how you looking? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I see I'm spinning. Kevin says his favorite part about being a barber is instilling confidence in his clients. And he's even started a not-for-profit called Waving Hope to My Community to inspire young kids like him. I just try to show everybody that you can be like me with waves and not have to be in the streets or like a gangster or nothing like that. Though some in the area call Kev the best barber in town, he still thinks he's got some learning to do. That's the difference between me and a lot of, a lot of other people is that I love to actually learn what I don't know. But one thing he knows for sure, his love for cutting hair is only growing. In Buffalo, Jetty Johnson, 7 Eyewitness News.